You've been working on. <laughs> you ought to know you're the director. Rock and roll. Rock and roll? Mm. Mm. Oops. Um, I can't. Oh dear God, what a terrible. It's a film being made in Pompeii, mostly in Italy. And it's about the Pink Floyd, of course. Are you fairly happy about the film? <sighs> what do you mean, happy? Well, I mean, do you feel that um, it's going in a, in, in a direction which is, which is interesting or not? What do you mean, interesting? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Mum. Hey. Hey. Hello, Mum. Hey. Just the oysters are good, aren't they? Yeah. Yes, there's good oysters here, aren't there? Yes. Yes. There's good oysters here. It seems to be the right season of year. A bit of grit on the your oysters are right. The oysters are very good. Yes, this time of year. Well, they're French oysters. Well, I don't know what nationality they are. I like to think that oysters transcend national barriers, Adrian. And it's a danger that we could become slaves of all our equipment. And in the past, we have been. But what we're trying to do is to sort it all out so that we're not. But I, I agree. I mean, it's a danger. It worries me sometimes that we have this so much equipment. And you can hide behind it. If I heard somebody saying that, I'd like to say, OK, well, you know, if we were at a gig, it'd be quite nice sometimes to say, OK, go on, <laughs> there it is. Get stuck in. In fact, you can open the show. It's going to be uh, 4,000 people in here in half an hour. Get up there and knock them out, man. And they'd then say, oh, but um, we don't know the equipment and we'd need time to rehearse. And, and so we say, yeah, well, so did we, about four or five years. To some extent, we're trying to simplify it out a little now and um, make it a little, make the logistics of it a little more organised. So it's, I mean, it, it has been a bit sort of Heath Robinson, a bit the mad scientist laboratory on the stage. Put one on it, Bob. Look, I'm trying to ask serious questions. <laughs> yeah. What's going on? The oysters put you in a good mood for working. Yeah, right. Well, they certainly seem to, don't they, Rach? Um. <laughs> <laughs> this is ridiculous. There's no good coming I'm in here trying to be serious. I'm losing it? my grip. My grip on things. <laughs> Somebody out there died. You're talking now. Alright. Okay. Someone's choking. Right. No. Do um, oysters put you in a good mood for working? Adrian. Look, this has Why got don't you to ask stop. That again? This <laughs> attempt to elicit conversation out of the chaps is doomed to failure. They know you're trying to get them to talk. <laughs> And they're not. Don't no, if, you, if you just spoke to us naturally, as if we were having a natural conversation, he said in a very loud voice. <laughs> oh, there's some difficult moments. What do you mean by that? Oh, there's some difficult moments, yes. You don't know what David means, or you don't know what. I don't know what Adrian means by that. Well, then you're fucking thick. Don't. <laughs> <laughs> you're part of my friend. I don't know what are we digging at. Well, I mean, what do you want to know about it? I mean, obviously, they're all a gang of idiots, but. You know, live and let live. Yeah. Right, rock on. Yeah. Quiet. Because we've been together for such a long time, we've definitely passed various peaks of disagreement and worked out methods of living with each other and getting on well with each other. I mean, we're, we're happy together. We're not... We don't work and that's it. We're not held together by simply by the bond of success or money or whatever. <laughs> He's not very important. No, 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 no. It's not me. Don't waste any film on him. He is only... smile, Chris, and wait. What's the French for he is only a rape? Say hello, Mum. <laughs> Go on, Chris. <coughs> there are not any problems or strains? Yes, or... of course there are. Hmm. How do you get round them? We pretend they're not there. We certainly don't face up to them in an adult way, if that's what you mean. Mm. 
sense of humour. We don't live together, we live miles right. apart. We've been going together a long time. We work together, yes. we haven't been going together. <laughs> <laughs> we, <go steady. laughs> we work together occasionally. We have a great understanding. Whenever we run out of money. <laughs> and tolerance. So and I suppose it's a question of money. Adrian. That's all it is, Adrian. Adrian, you're being very provocative. <laughs> <laughs> trying to be very provocative. Well, I'm doing my best, but well, we refuse to rise. Right. Quite. Certainly not to jive like that. I don't know, we understand each other very well. We're very tolerant with each other. Uh, but there are a lot of things unsaid as well, I feel, sometimes. How do you but get over the difficult times? Well, they're not that difficult. And we do. I don't know how we get over it, but we do.